Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Aquarius. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Aquarius. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Aquarius, as it takes care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages source your guardian angels and ancestors have for you in regards to love, Aquarius. Yes, love, love, love is in the air, Aquarians. Shout out to the evolving spirits. Shout out to the soul tribe. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. I appreciate you. I thank you all so much. Shout out to the ones that are new here. Thank you guys as well for stopping by. Don't forget to click that join link down below. It gives you exclusive discounts on your personal readings, your email questions, and your love live stream questions when I go live, my loves. Okay, so first we're going to start with some messages from your higher self. All right, and then definitely stick around. We're going to use the Love Romance Angel deck. Finish up with the Tarot deck and get you some word advice from your guardian angels and ancestors. I say, all right, Source Angels, Ancestors, please protect my space and aura as I channel the messages here today for Aquarius placements. What do their higher self want to inform them at this time, guardian angels, ancestors? We already got one card here. We have... A time for healing, Aquarius, okay? A time for healing, okay? I really strongly suggest you actually take this time out while we are in this season right now, all right? I really feel like there is something here that's needed to be healed from here, okay? This could be in regards to something on a more spiritual, personal level here for you, all right? This is what your higher self is wanting to inform you at this time, okay? So you're needing to heal from a situation here, a circumstance here, something that may have occurred here in the past, okay? This could be with a significant other here. This could be with a family member here, okay? This is something that's needed to be, you know, made aware of so that you can heal from this particular situation or circumstance here, okay? What else, for the angels, ancestors, do we have here for Aquarius placements when it comes to their higher self? Thank you. We have hold your vision, all right? Fixed moon here, okay? There's a lot of purple here standing out here as well, all right? So I really feel like whatever this is, you're halfway here as well. So whatever this vision that you have, Aquarius, whatever this is that you want to manifest for yourself, okay? I feel like you're halfway there. You're halfway to the finish line here, okay? So hold your vision, <clears throat> excuse me, in regards to whatever this is, I all of a sudden, my throat chakra got clogged up there. So make sure that you are speaking your truth, all right? Make sure that you're not afraid to speak up for what you feel when it comes to this particular situation and what you're wanting to manifest for yourself, all right? Definitely work on your throat chakra there, okay? What's at the bottom of the deck? We have you are good enough. Yes, full moon in Virgo, all right? You are the Aquarians, honey, we love you and your uniqueness, okay? We love how authentic you are and how you just bring your uniqueness to the table here, okay? So know that you are good enough, okay? Full moon in Virgo here. Some of y'all, this person that you're engaging with here could be a Virgo placement here, okay? So let's dive deeper into your love life here. All right, source angels, ancestors of the highest light. What do you have for Aquarius placements here? Let's now see what's going on in your love life here. All right, so make sure that you are definitely finding time to heal, all right, so that way you can be rejuvenated here and ready to go for your future manifestations here with hold your vision, okay? And know that whatever this is, if this is in regards to like a platform like I myself have or whatever type of crowd or organization or group that you're going to be involved in here. Know that you're good enough, Aquarius, and that you can do this, okay? Don't give up on yourself. Don't give up on your passions and your dreams here. Know that you can manifest and do whatever you put your mind to, okay? So those are messages from your higher self, all right? Let's go ahead and dive a little deeper here into your love life. For the month of July, Garden Angels Ancestors, what do we have coming towards Aquarius placements? When it comes to their love life here in the month of July, 
What do they need to know, Guardian Angels? What do we have for Aquarius? Wow, we have passion here. Ooh, all right. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy here. Okay, so you definitely have someone here that's very, very passionate towards you. Okay, some of y'all, this person could be a fire sign here, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries here. All right, Aquarius, but there's a lot of passion here between you and this connection with this person here. All right, there's going to be a lot of passion here, okay? Wow, what else we have? Trust. Yes, this situation is calling for you to have faith. All right, don't give up when it comes to your love life, Aquarius here, okay? I know, again, that the healing here that you are processing here, like I said, could have even been from a past relationship here or a marriage here some type of relationship here that you were in in the past here and you're having to heal okay so don't give up when it comes to your love life i feel like definitely this situation had to close out this chapter here for you because you have someone coming in here someone that's going to be compassionate someone that's going to be supportive to you be your backbone here all right love you uh, you know authentically here yes i heard authentically yes this person basically aquarius is going to love you for who you are and like the way how you do things and love your confidence here that you have in yourself so you have to trust that this situation is going to manifest for you you have to trust that you are going to be able to manifest the partner that you've always wanted here okay we have let your friends help you ask for and accept support from others here Yes, Aquarius, don't be afraid to ask, okay? I feel like your guardian angels and your ancestors are sending you help in at this time here when it comes to your love life, when it comes to whatever type of separation that some of you all may be going through here. I feel like your guardian angels and ancestors is sending in family members, people that are willing to help you here. Definitely, if you had a family here, situation here that you're separating from your significant other or your ex-spouse here, okay? You're getting help along the way here, okay? So again, hold your vision. Don't give up. Know that you can still manifest whatever this is you have passion towards and whatever this is that you want to manifest for yourself. All right. Yes, we have religious factors here. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. Okay. Meaning that the same faith that you had years ago. Okay, when it comes to you, your higher self, the creator of the heavens and earth, it's the same faith and passion that you can still have now. Okay, we all go through our ups and downs here, Aquarius. Okay, but know that you still are spiritually being protected and guided here. Okay, know that that same faith you had years ago is still here. Okay, wow, thank you, Guardian Angels. And then the last card we have is yes, getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens here. So there is someone here that's coming in here for some of you all that you don't even have the slightest clue. Okay, this is why you need to hold your vision here. And others of you all, you have already met this particular person here. It's why I feel you're kind of skeptical here and needing to trust this situation here. Okay, trusting this person here. Okay, and trusting that this person was sent to you for a reason here. And the more that you get to know this person, you're going to be able to see here for yourself, Aquarius, okay? So this is going to be like your own confirmation in regards to this connection here, all right? Wow, beautiful messages there. Definitely if the messages so far has resonated with your spirit and your higher self, Aquarius, don't forget to like, all right? Hit that big fat thumbs up, show spirit some love. Again, if you're new here, my loves, welcome, welcome, subscribe, my loves, be a part of family. This is where we love and we evolve each and every day here on this platform, okay? So let's see what the tarot deck has to say here. Let's see what we have here in tarot land for you, all right? Wow, we have the world card here, okay? This card talks about completions, okay? There is a cycle here that's ended for you, okay? So no more going back and looking in the past here, okay? You need to continue to hold your vision here again because you have something new coming here, okay? You have a new cycle, a brand new cycle of passion, a brand new cycle, but it's going to be true genuine love here as well. So know that you're good enough for anything and anyone, okay? What else are guarding angels? So that card for me as well, meaning that you passed the test, Aquarius. The world card is here. You passed the test, all right? You now have your free will to move forward. What else, Garden Angels, in regards to Aquarius placements? What else do they need to know?
thank you we have two cards here we have the seven of pentacles here this is earth energy here taurus capricorn and virgo so there's definitely someone that wants to invest in you there's definitely someone that wants to take out the time to get to know you all right like i said some of you out this person here could be an earth sign here or a fire sign here but there's definitely someone that wants to manifest in you or establish a foundation here with you Aquarius here but I feel like because of the situation here and what you've been through in your past here you're kind of skeptical about this situation here okay some of y'all like I said is with this person that you have met here not too long ago and you're getting to know this person and you're just not quite too sure you have to make sure to follow your intuition and use your discernment here Aquarius yes here you are you're showing up in your own reading here we have the Queen of Swords here, okay? This is your energy, Aquarius, Gemini, and Libra energy here, okay? You're making sure to, of course, set healthy boundaries for yourself, okay? Because this is how you're coming off to people here, okay? They see that you're very strong-minded here, all right? And you definitely have your head on your shoulders here, and you are definitely putting your foot down for or towards people, places, and situations here, okay? So... This is why it is important here to follow your intuition here at the same time here, okay? Because you have energies around you that are for you and want to help assist you along the way here on your spiritual path, okay? And because the way you were treated in your past and because you were hurt here in your past, this is how you're still showing up and coming out. And this is why your guardian angels want you to find time, your higher self, to heal because you are still coming off really strong-hearted here, Okay, a little defensive, not as much because this is you naturally. All right, <clears throat> but however, <clears throat> yeah, that go my throat chakra again. All right, making sure that you're speaking your truth here. Okay, why you're healing at the same time. Okay, but not having to come off so defensive. Okay, because these people that are coming in is going to be people here. I feel that's going to want to help you along the way here. You know, keep you in that you know spirit of love here. Okay. So embrace these new people, energies that you're going to be around. These are people you may meet at your job. These are people that you may meet out while you're on your daily routine. Okay, I really feel like Spirit is definitely sending you some help in here. Yes, we have the Six of Pentacles here. This talks about the year number six here. Things balance, balancing out for you. Giving, even, take energies that are wanting to come in here. Okay, I really feel like in regards to your finances and career here, it's going to also be balanced out here for you as well, Aquarius here, okay? All right, so be mindful of the energies that is coming in towards you here, okay? I want to see how this person is here that's coming towards you if you haven't met this person already. Others of you, like I said, you've already met this person here. Let's see how they feel towards you. Guardian angels, ancestors, whoa. Wow, we have, they can't do what you do to me. Wow, Aquarius. So whatever it is that you do to this particular person here, they cannot do it like how you do it, here, okay? Fuck it up, Aquarius. Yes, and this is what this person loves about you. This is why it may be kind of skeptical for you because you're meeting this person and it's like they're telling you all the right things, right? So you're like, wait a minute, okay? So I get it. I totally understand, okay? Because I really see that you really have your guard up very heavy and very strong okay towards this new energy that's coming in here all right and some of you have already like i said i knew you were a freak wow okay so some of y'all have already went past that stage here and got a little intimate here in the bedroom here honey is why this person's like damn aquarius they can't do what you do to me and yet all right we have i can't take my eyes off of you Wow, so this person can't take their eyes off of you. You're very attractive to this person here. I feel like because you are very showing up with this confidence energy here, all right, you're sticking to your guns here, you're putting your foot down. I feel like this person really finds this sexy about you as well, Aquarius here. They really like that about you. It turns them on, all right? Yes, we have, I want to hit it from the back. Wow, all right? So, yes, this person definitely does a lot of fantasizing about you, okay? Like I said, because there is a lot of passion here between you two, okay? So, you know, like I said, this person could be a fire sign here, an earth sign here, okay? Or they could be a fellow air sign like yourself here, all right? So, let's move on here. Let's get you some word advice from your guardian angels and your ancestors regarding your spirit here today. 
Again, definitely if the reading has resonated, don't forget to like, subscribe, and definitely hit that notification bell so that way you are notified for when I do go live. All right, you are welcome to ask love questions there as well. When you become a Soul Tribe member, you also get discounts on your love live stream questions as well and your personal readings that you book with me. I am now available for personal readings. If you would love to book a personal reading with me, all that information is down below in the description box, my loves. Guardian Angels and Sisters, what word of advice can Aquarius placements take away from this spread today? What word of advice here can Aquarius placements take away from this spread? Whoa, thank you. That was quick. All right. Wow. We have within the next few weeks here, Aquarius. Okay. So this is going to occur for you in the next few weeks here. Okay. So this particular person here, like I said, for the ones that haven't met this particular energy yet, all right, I really feel like you're going to meet this person here in the next few weeks here. Whatever this is, again, that you've been manifesting for yourself here, I feel like it's going to pick up here for you within the next few weeks, okay? Definitely make sure that you're still focusing in on yourself. You're finding time to heal here so you can be ready for this opportunity here that's coming in here for you within the next few weeks here, Aquarius. Wow, beautiful reading here again. Again, definitely if the reading has resonated with your spirit and your higher self, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Again, I am available for personal readings. All that information is down below in the description box, my loves. And shout out to the Evolving Spirits. Shout out to the Soul Tribe. I love you all so much. Stay healthy. Stay wealthy. Bye-bye.